What is going on guys? It's Emil here. We are back with more Cart Road to Nines. This time we're back on custom tracks since, you know, things usually go a lot better on custom tracks if I'm being honest. So what we're, so Starter Gate Summit on 100cc. The first thing I'm thinking of right, I actually didn't get shrooms. Okay, well I thought I would get shrooms. So that's honestly not a very good start. So I'm just gonna throw that over there and uh, you know, I was really hoping that would hit somebody. Okay, maybe this isn't going to be as easy as I thought. Because I saw the room on the Weem5 page. And I really didn't want to get into it. But now that we're in here. What I can tell you guys is that there's a lot of low VR in here. And I think I'll be able to take advantage of my lines in this room. As opposed to how I usually play. Where I have to try to play around items. Especially on a track like this. As long as I get some mushrooms. I should be able to formulate some sort of plan to get up to the front. And maybe stay there. And this is the perfect time to do that. Now, all I have to worry about right now is the possibility of a spammed shock. Uh, I'm gonna wait, actually. Since this is actually a really close pack. Like, it's even closer than I imagined. Ah, I really wanted the dodge, dude. That's so bad. Anyway, we're just this week, we're kind of just trying to make up for the bad session we had last week. Hopefully, we can do that. So far, that was a really good shroom cut, actually. Yeah, I don't think I can get a mini turbo there, so I'm kind of just gonna super mini around this. I think a counter hop here is probably ideal so I can get a really early super mini turbo. Oh, this guy! That just ruined my entire plan, dude. I was all set. Wait, never mind. People are taking really bad lines. So if I can just keep holding on like this. Where did you come from? You know what? Not even going to bother questioning it. I'm going to wait right here. You know, the people pass. No, he took the box. Okay, well, this is bad. I don't have to worry about the guy in first since he's at like 9999 already. That's actually gonna hit me. That's actually hitting me. Wow. This is really bad. Dude. Okay, I really need to react to these boxes a lot better. Okay, if I lose this, if I get any spot below like fifth or something, I'm literally losing. I'm gonna get all the way down to not like 8.8k. So I need to get a good spot here. Bad. Spam it, dude. I'm relying on a spam. Really? He's not spamming it, and I don't know why. Oh, come on. Oh, my God. Fifth? I don't know what I got. Oh, no. I think that's just losing VR. I got 4th and I lost 42. That's what I mean, guys. This room is honestly on a different level of... Generally... Kinda weak. <laughs> if I'm being honest. But... I need to get better tracks. And I need to get more item boxes. So I can get up to the top 2 spots and be able to gain. Let's hope we can do that. 100cc... Tropical Factory. Well, you see... My dreams for being able to just outline all of the room are already kind of dying if it's if this is the tr if these are the tracks we're going to be picking. Actually, never mind. We might be able to manage it still. Okay, so far so good actually. Now, I don't really know what to do in this section. I'd imagine going through the middle is probably still fastest. Okay. Right now, I don't think I have anything to worry about unless there's a blue, obviously, because this phase guy is probably going to be pretty close to me this entire time. Just going to back a green there. Maybe it'll hit him. Nah, actually, I don't think I'll be able to hit anyone with this. But so far, my lines are looking kind of clean. But the problem here is that it's 100cc, and we're going to get spam shocks. That's one of my main problems right now. That's okay, though. I can still work with this because I just have to snake my way over. I should be good. Okay, that was a really awkward angle, but honestly, oh, we're fine right now. We are big chilling. All right. I don't really know what else to say about this race, so I, I might as well start talking about new season of lounge. So, the day as, as of the day I'm recording this, the lounge season six started yesterday, and I know a lot of people have been asking me one common question since I came back to lounge and that is if I'm going to be bringing back Road to Master. Now, in all honesty, 
The real answer there is I honestly can't tell you whether or not I'm bringing it back. It's not, it's not like one of those things where it's like, oh yeah, I'm gonna keep it like a secret. No, it's like genuinely like, I actually have no idea whether or not I'll have time to bring it back because as much as I'd love to bring back the series, I have a lot of work to do in college compared to high school. And that's gonna be taking up a lot of my time. Like usually I'd love to play a lot of Mogis for the series and it's honestly really fun to do that too because trying to get an MMR in lounge is something I've loved doing for a really long time. And I've been getting a lot better at it too. So I feel like Road to the Master like would actually be a feasible idea. But the thing is it won't end there because there's a new rank in lounge. I'll just run you guys through some of the new lounge stuff real quick. In case you didn't know, there's actually two new ranks this season. There's Emerald, and then above Master, there's Grand Master. So Emerald, I think, was kind of to replace the idea of Gold 1 and Gold 2. Kind of have a good um, borderline between Gold and Plat- or no, sorry, Platinum and Diamond. My bad. That's kind of what the role of Emerald is. And when it comes to, like, Grand Master, that's going to be there for people who really want to grind it. Now, you've probably seen people with the roles like RT Master Season 1 or like, in my case, CT Master Season 1, 2, and 3. Those roles are still going to be handed out from what I've heard. And if, in actuality, it's just going to be like... I have to go around here because I feel like that Stomper was going to kill me. Yeah, it was. But Grand Master roles will be handed out as well along with Masters. And it's going to be a lot easier to reach that on CTs. Now, I know... People would obviously want to see a Grandmaster, like me reaching for Grandmaster. And honestly, I don't know whether or not I'd want to do it on CTs. And that's just a, a stop for stopping me. And wow, I'm just gone from everybody. That's how this room really is when it comes to tracks like this. I figured when I saw this track getting picked, it would be a race like this. But let me know, let me, guys, let me know in the comments, like, what you guys want to see. If you guys want to see, if you guys want to see Road to Grandmaster, or if you just want me to try to reach for Master on regs. Definitely down for either because I feel like I can reach master at least on regs Grandmaster would be a little bit trickier to reach, but I feel like that's also possible And yeah, we're just breaking away. This looks like a plus VR race for us GCN for life kind of getting killed back there. So I feel like that is going to be a pretty So oh, it's not gonna be a decent gain. It's gonna be like a very subpar gain. I Don't even know. Let's just see what happened. I feel like I'm just going to be gaining like 50, maybe 60. I don't see myself gaining any more than that unless GCN for Life VR really does a lot for me. Yeah, 51. So these gains are honestly going to be really slow in this room because of how low the VR is. And unless more high VR people join, then we're going to have to keep relying on driving and slow gains like that, which honestly I'm fine with because a gain is a gain at the end of the day. So I think I'll be fine with that. I, um, <laughs> GCN Bowser Castle. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, well, I love this track. Really, I do. This track is one of my favorite retros of all time. Yeah, granted, I never played Mario Kart Double Dash, but even though this is one of my favorite retros of all time, it's 100cc, and this track is already over like three minutes long. That's my only problem with it, and I really hope none of the ramps are going to cause problems for me. I feel like all the turns are just going to be like a million times easier since, uh, you know, it's a hundred, so I'll be able to take them all with relative ease. I somehow didn't hit a fireball there. I thought I would. Uh, I think I have time to squeeze out a mini turbo here. No, I don't. I thought I did. Oh, GCN for life. What are you doing, bro? Kind of choking there. <laughs> um... Yeah, but this section here should be pretty easy to snake around. That's all we really need to do. And honestly, I don't really know what else to do. Uh, I'm gonna try backing him. Nah, he need to avoid it. Now, nah, I think the fireball should be going over the other side at that point. So we should be good. And right now, oh, we're just gone. It's just me and GCN for life. So uh, honestly, I don't know what I'll do. Oh my gosh, look at that skilled pow dodge. He thought he was going to get a red shell on me. Mm -mm. Nah, bro. You got to try harder than that. See, it's not that easy with Cart Mom in the room. When you know all the custom tracks, it's really easy to break away from people. Well, only in low VR rooms. In high VR rooms, people actually know the tracks better. And then you actually have to try your best to not dive. And then 
I don't know. There's just a lot to deal with on custom traps when it comes to the skill gap because in rooms like this, it's really just easy breakaways. And honestly, with how this room is going, I might actually try to join a different room after it. After this race, maybe. I don't know. But the other rooms are looking kind of full right now. That's why I can't really get in anything. That pal is going to kill GCN for life. Wow. Oh, that shot's going to bring him right back, though, because now he gets an item box. Can I get a super mini here? Yes, I can. Too easy, man. Too easy. Now I just got to worry about getting killed. I'm going to put another Nana here. And I think the fireball should be going there. Oh, wow. I was way off. But you know what? Still able to avoid it. And I'm getting blued. That's alright. I don't mind being in second. Oh, he's got a fib. Oh, he tried. Oh, he had nanas. Oh, well. See, the only way I'm going to catch him now is if there's a blue. Because, you know, Flame Runner versus Wild Wing. Pretty significant speed difference. A mushroom is decent, but I don't know if it'll be enough for me. I also don't know if he's going to try to backspam me. That's the other problem. Like, it's kind of just a 1v1 this race, even though there's like, oh, like 10 other racers. Yeah, it's not even like a real race. Now, this, oh, that's a clean spiral, actually. Oh, he failed again. Is he hitting fire? Nah, he's not. Hmm, I'm going to see if I can try to get him out of first. Like, I'm kind of curious to see if I can do it. Oh, he's failing hard. I'm going to try a green snap right here. Oh, shoot. Wait. Oh, I thought that green was going to hit. Wait, I can catch him here. This actually makes it so possible for me to catch him. Because if I resize right here, and if I get a box... Okay. I need to be really careful. I actually thought he was about to get hit by that. Oh, shoot. Maybe an anti hit at the landing? Nah, he's getting first. That's alright, though. Still, decent spots there. And oh my, I didn't even realize how far behind people are. Oh my goodness. Now I'm going to look at the Weem5 page real quick and see if I can find a better C2 Worldwide room. Because right now, there really isn't that much going on for C2 Worldwide. And I really need to see if I can get something going. Even though we're gaining VR here, it's a really slow game. But it all just comes down to what rooms are happening. And the only other room that I see right now is actually not too bad. So I'm going to try to get in that room. And when I get in that room, I will be back. 9100 right now. Really good stuff. So let's see if we can get in that other C2 Worldwide room. And I will see you guys when the race starts in there. All right. We got into the room with the better VR average. And I'm noticing some strange combos. But that's nothing to worry about because we're playing Melting Magma Melee. Now... Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think we've played this track on the series yet. And if that's the case, this is going to be a really cool race. Because I actually want to see how well I can do on a cart versus all the bikers. I'm pretty familiar with this track, as it is already on a bike. Because I've just played so much of this track in, like, CT Leagues and with, like, you know, YN and Daisy Squad. Because this used to be one of Daisy Squad's go-to tracks. And now I'm going to try this cut here. Ah, uh, I didn't get a good exit, but I made the cut. Oh, it's Rizzer that's over here. Oh, he's getting blue because I didn't make it properly. Oh, I feel bad. I'm so sorry, Rizzer. Oh, where is he getting blued? All right. That's a fine spot to get powered. I just have to worry about, you know, not getting a mini turbo. It's really hard to get mini turbos on this track at all because of this downward slope, but that's all right. Already in first place. That's exactly what I'd like to see. If I can try to get a breakaway a little bit, this will be really good. Now... The only part I'm worried about really is like this section here because it's okay. Well, see, that's another reason I'm worried about it because I just died. Yo, we got Tofu Boy on a cart as well. Let's go. So we like to see the cart and spirit. Uh, I'm going to go up a little bit to avoid getting powed in a really bad spot. I Another blue because I choked first and it's for Rizzer again. Oh, no. Crap. That's not good. Oh, Tofu Boy's off the track, too. I don't think he got the... Yeah, he didn't get the startup boost. That's all right. All I have to do is go off this little loop-de-loop -loop here. And, uh... Another blue. Oh, my gosh. And it's going for Rizzer again. That's unbelievable. 
Wow. I feel bad, dude. He's gotten blue three times because of people messing up. I'm, I genuinely feel bad for him. Also, old B Rosa not even using Rosa. Um, yeah. All right. That makes sense. I think you should be using Rosa if you're, if you have Rosa in your name, but hey, maybe that's just me. Like, you know, me using cart moms or cards since I have cart mom in my name. Now, will there be another blue shell? <gasps> Rizzer did not get target shark that time. Thank the Lord for that. Uh, that's a really bad pal for me, but it'll help me gain on old B Rosa just a tiny bit. Hopefully they didn't get a box. And this mini turbo here should get me into first. Please not off the track. Let's go. All right. All I have to do now is just keep first place here. Oh, slow because of the wheelie. That is 100% because of the wheelie. Because cart max speed, if you haven't already noticed, is 109. Oh, my. I meant to drift left. Or, yeah, I was trying to drift left, and it didn't let me. Oh, thank you, Tofu. Boy. Oh, my. I'm off again. Okay, this is bad. This is going bad. I'm somehow still in fifth. Sixth. Okay, this is fine. Brian putting in some work. All right, Brian. Uh, that shock is honestly really good for me. Because now I can get a box here, maybe. Right? Or not. Okay. We can catch up to everybody else here. I think I can get third with this race at best. If I get, like, shrooms or something, I can get third here. But that's what it comes down to. Am I going to pull a mushroom item? Or am I going to pull, like, shells? Okay, I pulled shells, which is honestly still just as good. But old B Rosa in a mega. By some miracle, didn't get hit. Wait. Am I beating him? Am I beating him? Oh my god, did I beat him? I actually have no idea whether or not that was good enough. Was that good enough? I actually want to know. The race won't be finishing for a couple more seconds, but that is just the one thing on my mind right now. Is that going to be good enough to gain some VR in this room? Because I know some people have decent high VR, and it really just comes down to who I beat and who beats me. So I really hope that we're in the optimal spot here. Are we? We got third plus 26. Nice. 91, 26. Small gain. But that's really all I that's really what I can get with this with these rooms that have been going on today. And that's honestly not too bad of a gain either for third. So I'm gonna keep trying to see if I can gain more VR, maybe get to 9200 today. I don't know, we'll see. We'll do like three or four more races here. Ooh, baby, Cortex Castle. This is a really fun track. I like playing this track on mirror mode, and especially on a cart, because there aren't too many chances for bikes to just like break away here. There's like Maybe like a couple seconds at most, but carts really have a good chance here because of this section in particular. Like this is all about keeping your speed up, just getting many turbos galore. And that was a really good way to take that section. And I'm getting a little bit of a breakaway as well. That's what matters right now. Now I'm gonna back a green here because I kind of want to get everyone off my tail. Uh, I didn't land a hit, but that's all right. We're already breaking away from everybody a little bit and I'm gonna wait to release my mini turbo here. All part of the plan, dudes. All part of the plans. Now, I think I can... Ah, oh, shoot. Am I landing on that? No! That's terrible. All right, maybe I should have slowed down before taking that cut, but that's all right. Someone failed it back here. We're probably going to get a spam shot because of it. That's all right. Triple shrooms is all we need to catch right back up. Maybe. Keyword, maybe. I'm not 100% sure about that. And if I saw correctly, I think we have another Carter joining us as well. Yep, I see someone on another Wild Wing from the looks of it. And more Triple Shrooms is perfect for me right now. Now, the only problem here is that the Flame Runners up front are going to have a little bit of an advantage. But that's alright. That's all. That's the only reason we're playing carts in this series instead of bikes. We are about that disadvantage. We are about trying to take advantage of all the good things that we can get in a race. And we're already right back up to fifth place. And a golden really isn't the item I wanted here. But it is useful. There is okay, you are really scaring me. Where is he? Oh, he failed. Okay. So this is really good for me. And I, I guess that guy didn't get mega after all. So he's holding a top spot right now. I don't really have to worry too much about old B Rosa since they have more VR than me anyway. And that's not what this is about. This is about getting second place. 
any spot that gains VR is a position that I am perfectly okay with. Now, I'm really surprised. Oh, wait. Oh, never mind. I thought Old B-Rails have failed, but Battle Glitch is just doing its job, and this guy is really not doing a very good job of holding his spot right now. He has triple reds in second, and now someone has a TC behind me. Oh, boy. How am I ever going to... Well, no, you are not passing me a TC. No, 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 no. Not how it works. Now, unfortunately, I can't pass this guy since he's holding two reds. And I'm assuming that he knows how to do the cut, so... Oh, he just backed them all. I don't know why he would do that. Ah, uh, nope. I'm just gonna... I am gonna have to take third for this race unless there's another blue. Wow, were there really no other blues after I got blued off first lap? That's... Wow, that's actually upsetting. <laughs> that's genuinely cringe. I don't know if I'm gonna gain for that. Just because of that blue shell. We might actually be losing VR off of that, and if that's the case, that's not going to be very good on us for the series right now. So let's just hope that we can gain VR for third place in such a small room with a weird VR average. Are we going to be gaining minus four? Yeah, this is something I was worried about. When it comes to smaller rooms and we're at 9k, getting even lower spots like this with the averages is just dreadful. And the room did fill up though, so that's what we're all about. If if rooms fill up and we get mid spot like top spots, then we're pretty much guaranteed VR gain almost every race. All right, ladies and gentlemen, now I present to you one of my least favorite custom tracks of all time, Skygrove. Well, I I really there, there's not much to say here. The only real downside that I can think of right now is that I actually can't take the ending cut in a cart. That's just the worst part about this track anyone else in the room is going to be free to take it but i am going to be struggling if i wanted to take it i should be good with a hop trick uh nope not even that wow i honestly don't even remember how to do that and mirror mode did throw me off a little bit but that's okay um uh, all right bumped me out of the way of the box this is already off to a very unfortunate start and i just have to like try to get an item here because if i don't I'm doomed. Ah, uh, triple shrooms isn't going to be the item I need. I'm going to try to get it. Yeah, that's why I didn't want triple shrooms. I had a feeling shock was going to be spammed any second, and that's, and that's just when it came. So if I go for a box out here, I should be getting triple shrooms, maybe a golden. Yeah, triple shrooms. That's about expected. Now, wait. I think top two's failing. Top two's failing. Nice. That's going to be my chance to come back here. Awesome. Right back in third i think i'm in third let's go that's so good now i'm gonna use a shroom here just to get up next to this top two. Oh, i didn't even know i was already oh i didn't have a super mini i thought i did my bad uh nope that's bad uh oh he's off i'm gonna trick here just because i want to reach a lower oh my god jam trick it's always funny to see jam tricks. Yeah, that's why I didn't go for the cut that time. Oh my gosh. It is so hard to get out of that current. <laughs> I never thought about how hard it is to get out of that current until now. Come on. Things are looking up. Things are looking up. Come on, baby. Come on. One time. One time. One time for cart, mom. Oh, no, you don't. One time. Yes. Let's go. Let's go, dude. Let's go. So good. So good. That was amazing. I think we're going to gain a little bit for that. 101. Nice. Dude, that's insane. GCN for life, my man. Having a tough race there. 101. Wow. The chances of me winning that were unbelievable. But we, we got it. Oh, my gosh. Let's go. I want to keep this win streak up. Come on, baby. Oh, boy. Time for a little bit of an endurance test, huh? We might as well get one of these sooner or later. Well, we already kind of did have one with GCN Bowser's Castle. But besides the point, now we're in an actual room where things are going to matter. And we actually have decent competition in this room. Unlike in the last room where it was only GCN for life. But now we have him along with a couple others that are actually able to keep up. And so far, this start is really solid. Hmm, can I pinpoint that, that other player? Uh, I thought I could. I pinpointed somebody. Yeah, old B-Rosa's got a lot of opportunity to gain on me, but they're not really taking advantage of that right now. 
I, I'm kind of surprised by that. Now I need to see if I can find a place where I can back this fib right in their face. How about right here? No. Oh my! Now I have no idea if- Oh, they actually got an item! Oh! Alright. Still on the track, that's what matters. That sh Wait. Did they just- Oh! He's off! Alright. Now... Okay, I'm not gonna be able to keep this, obviously, because, you know... He's obviously- Oh! Never mind, maybe I can. Can I make it up there like this? No, I can't. Whatever. That's alright. I'm not too concerned about that. I'm more concerned about, you know, not getting hit by roaming chain chomps. Uh, didn't even get a good... Wow, that was terrible. But it looked like my session... My, it was good enough to break away from people, so I guess that's just what matters. Now, I don't know how to take this in a card. Do I snake it? Do I not snake it? Okay, I guess I don't snake it. Maybe one mini turbo is all I need in there. And if that's the case, fine by me. I don't like driving that part anyway. Alright. Nothing really going on this race. And I ask... Oh, well, there's a blue shell. Okay, seriously. I got... There's got to be more people taking blues. No. Oh, that was scary. Alright. Oh, that, that wasn't an optimal line. No. Good attempt, but no. Oh, man. GCN for life is just the one person who's, like, actually able to scare me this room. Because he knows what he's doing. It seems like he knows what he's doing compared to everyone else. And that low trick is really cool. I'm going to back this at him. Did anyone hit the... F oh, the fib's still there. I guess that fib is kind of easy to see now that I'm thinking about it. Um, I think that's going to give me the edge over GCN for life for now. <laughs> for life for now. <laughs> anyway, um... This is honestly really close, but with everyone else being really far behind, it's kind of just a 1v1 scenario yet again. And is my fib going to be here still? No, it's gone by now. Really good stuff for me. And it's just, everything's just working out really smoothly right now. I really don't know what happened to old B Rosa after lap one. Uh, I would try to back this fib on GCN for life, but I don't think it's going to work out. I'm just going to back a green at him. And I'll back a fib here. Why not? Oh my, that hit him? You know? Oh, okay, that's cringe. What is this? That's just there. <laughs> I've never seen that before. I've actually never seen that. That's the first time I'm seeing that. Uh-oh. Uh, -oh. uh I'm not, I can't go for a box, I think. Oh, boy. Oh, uh, he was able to go for a box just fine. I don't think he got anything useful, though. Good stuff. Uh-oh. Come on. Okay, he didn't get triples, which is a good sign for me. Oh, he got another red, though. That's okay. You know what? I think I'm fine taking second place this race. But is there really not going to be a blue for him? Really? No blue? Ah, oh, that's unlucky. That's all right. But I think second place should still yield us a pretty solid gain for VR. I almost... Oh, the blue came after. Are you kidding me? Oh, that's genuinely cringe. That's okay, though. Well, I think we should be getting a pretty decent gain for that. Maybe a plus 60 or 70. Maybe a little bit less. Not 100% sure. But I would like to think that we are getting a little bit more than 30. Maybe. Just a possibility. I don't know. What are we getting? We're going to be getting 67. Nice. That should bring us to 92.90. All right. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to do two more races in here. And we're going to see if we can break into 9.3k. So far, this is going really good. And I really hope I'm not cursing myself by saying that. Let's give it a go, guys. Guys, our true test of custom track knowledge with a cart has finally come. Mushroom Peaks, everybody. This is going to be insane. I don't know how I'm going to do. I don't know if I need to go for Shroomless. I don't know if I even need to, like, try to stay on the track all the time. Because maybe that's not going to be worth it. But that's not what matters. What matters is how we end up doing at the end of the race. And I feel like this is a pretty universally known custom track at this point. It's like one of the oldest ones of, of all time. And I'm going to take... The we're not going to talk. We're, we're not going to talk about that, guys. We're not going to talk about that. You saw nothing. All right, now I did it right. That's what I meant to do the first time. But for some reason, I just completely missed the ramp. Ah, oh, someone was able to build through cut. Ah, oh, cheeky little guy. 
All right, that's all right. Wow, I'm in sixth, I'm sixth somehow. And spam shock. Okay, I don't know who that guy is. That guy has pretty decent VR, which is honestly even more confusing for me. And if I didn't mess up at the beginning like that, maybe I'd be up there with everybody else. But I guess it's not really too important since I'm not falling off right now. I almost drove right into the line of that bomb. I need to get ahead of him. That's not going to hit me, so we're safe now. Okay, that kept going for a while. That was... I was genuinely... Uh-oh. Wait, I don't think that's going to hit me either. Never mind, it is hitting me. I thought I could wall it, but I think I tried way too early. Okay, this is a bad spot to be in right now. Because we're prone to another shock in, like, no time at all. Now, the question it comes down to is, is he going to spam this one or is he going to chain it? That's what I really want to know. I have no idea how to really assess that at this point. I actually thought Brian was going to get rid of that banana, so I guess not. That's alright. Um, You know what? I really don't know what to do. I think I'm just going to go for a shroom item here. Maybe get one. I don't want that shroom item. Another blooper. Wow, this is unlucky. It's good to see the guy who picked this doing bad, though. Okay, I need a box here. Alright, triple shrooms. That's all good. That's all good. Now, if I remember correctly, the proper stretch of the mushroom section here is just spamming tricks. And I really hope I don't get TS'd. Alright, that's good. It's good to see GCN for life back here too. Now, I really don't know what to do with this, so I'm just going to use this now. Getting GCN for life after boxes. I feel kind of bad, but at the same time, no I don't. Because at the end of the day... This is about me gaining as many spots as I can for the end of the race. And I want to see if I can do it. Especially on a track as hard to play as this. And this is getting a little bit harder thanks to Brian's reds again. Wow, Brian is just obsessed with reds today for some reason. That is amazing to get. I'm just going to use this. I'm use it right now, actually. Maybe he'll spam it. That's actually surprising. I thought for sure he was going to spam the shock there. All right, maybe it's going to come later than I expect. I'm definitely chaining this. Oh, wait, that was a bad chain. Never mind, Brian's shells are gone. I'm going to back a bomb here. Nice, got a shroom. Two people died on shrooms. Oh, my God. Guys, guys, this is huge. This is huge. Okay, this is looking really good. He's trying to fit me. No, you don't. I got to shoot it first. Let's go. Come on, dude. This is the final stretch. This is this is everything we need being handed to us. The only thing that can come in our way right now is a red shell. Or a target shock. Either one. Hey, ground shroom. That's really good for me. Oh, my gosh. This is insane. We're actually doing it. We're actually managing this. We're going to do the impossible. We're going to beat out all the bikers on Mushroom Peaks. And I really hope I'm not, you know, prematurely celebrating. Is it going to happen? Am I getting TS? No, I am not. Oh, wait a minute. Let's go. Nice. First. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my gosh. That was awesome, dude. Yes. That was insanity. You love to see it, man. You honestly love to see it. Woo. All right. Well, if that's the case, we should be getting into 9.3K really easily. And ideally, we gain a good amount here as well. Are we going to be gaining a good amount here? 101 again, 93, 91. You know what? At this point, I think I'm just going to say one more race. I think I have time for one more race. If everything goes well, we get into 9.4 yet again, even though we've already been there but that's not the point we're just gaining vr as much as we can let's get it done all right ending on celestial ruins honestly not the biggest fan especially since i'm starting in first i was really trying to pick something along the lines of garden of dreams because i know that track can be really good for me if i pull you everything right and old b rosa is already causing some trouble oh wait they're finally on rosa i just noticed that let's go dude oh Bye, buddy. 
Sorry, didn't mean to slow on you, but well, you try to get in the way of a cart. And when you try to do that, you're more than likely going to catch up to them since you have wheelies. Sorry, old B-Rosa. What? All right, you lucky son of a gun. That's all right. Up oh, here comes another high, v high VR player. And I'm going to green you. Never mind. Oh, we're, ma we're making this poor Rosa suffer right now. That's, that's, you know what? I don't mind doing that. That's all part of the plan. I want to get a high spot of it as I can. I'm going to throw that there. Oh, got him. Let's go, dude. Woo! Oh, they had shrooms. All right. You know what? That's all right. It, because if they try to catch up to me, they're just going to get greened. Oh! <laughs> oh, that was such a good attempt. Wow. That was actually an amazing attempt. That almost went really good for them. But unfortunately, just because of the circumstances, it didn't quite turn out how they probably would have wanted it to. All right. Really good spot to be in, though. Even though there's a shroom cut here, I'm I'm starting to doubt that most people are going to be gaining too much from it. And if that's the case, we're honestly in a winning seat. Well, maybe not winning seat, but at least second place seat. Yeah, you get the idea. Oh, a blue shell coming in. I'm going to back these. I feel so bad. I'm just griefing this dude. But at the same time, why does that matter, dude? I'm, I'm trying to get up there as much as I can. Oh, you're in a star. Oh, gosh. Oh, I'm so tempted. But I, I, oh, never mind. He's getting blued. Oh, well, is that even a blue can? Oh, gosh. Someone's billing. Brian, once again. Brian's one of our notable names this session, honestly. At least that's how I feel. I feel like Brian's done a lot of damage this session to the point where he kind of deserves a spot up here. Well, that's not what I wanted to happen. Now, as long as no one backs any... Well, that works. What? What is happening? What is happening? I'm going to wait a little bit. This pack's really close, actually. I can afford to wait because maybe... Oh, that's not good. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use this up right away. Oh, wow, you son of a gun. All right. That's really bad for me. All right. That's okay. That's okay, though. That's okay. All depends on what we get right here. If we get shock, we're in a really good spot. That is not a shock. I'm going to go around and chain this, honestly. Because I don't see any point in taking cut. It doesn't even save that much time. So I'm just going to go for this right here. Maybe I get something good. He pulled Bill. So that means I have to pull shock, right? Yes! Pulled the shock. Now, I don't think we're going to get anything above third this race. But that's not important. I'm just going to use this right here. And they dodged one person. That's unimportant. And a golden... Really poor item to get right here, but it's still useful. That's what matters right now as long as the item is useful As long as the item can carry me to the top of the, the top spot. That is what matters and that's not a top spot Can I keep fifth at least? No, oh no, I think I got sixth. but even if I got six that's gonna be a minimal VR loss Did I get sixth? Fifth and minus 26. You know what that is just fine gaining about 300 VR this session. Not too bad at all. Pretty solid session. But, you know, that's going to be all I've got for you guys today. And that's honestly a really good way to end the session. Thank you guys so much for watching this week's episode of Cart Road to Nines. I know some races were kind of boring. And I, you know, that's kind of my bad on that. But overall, really good session overall. Hope, anyway, do the usual. Like, comment, subscribe. Leave your comments below about what you want to see from Mogi Lounge. Now we'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.